guys, welcome to our weekly video blog. My name is Jessica Rangel, I'm here with Jerry Majorotti, and today we're going to be discussing modular office cubicles. Jerry, help me understand exactly what modular office furniture is. Well, modular office furniture, there's multiple different, different styles. It could be a cubicle, it could be a built-in office, it could be desking components, which we're kind of getting used to now in the marketplace because we're doing different options for our cubicle components and modular furniture. So there's multiple options in that area. Uh, it could be simple as a cubicle, like I said, which is components that go on an open floor concept, or modular desking as well. It's the same. It's just a different configuration if we want to have collaboration or if we want to have privacy for the staff that are working in those areas. Jerry, what is the price range of modular office furniture? Uh, there's quite a bit of price range depending upon if you're going with standard cubicles. Those could start out at seven to nine hundred dollars a piece. You can go all the way up to desking components and or built-in offices that could range anywhere from fifteen hundred to two thousand and up depending upon the components you want to have in that for the particular staff. Sometimes you'll have uh, general office staff in your lower priced end units and you'll have management into middle price units and you'll have upper management in other price units. So it, there's a quite a bit of a range there specifically tied into what um, areas you're trying to focus on for those different levels of staff. So Jerry, what are the benefits for a customer for doing office cubicles? Well, there's lots of benefits. It's uh, what, what we do when we do office cubicles or modular furniture is we use an open space plan concept. So obviously there's less build out costs for the tenant moving in because you're not building sheet rocked offices. So when you get into an open concept, there's obviously cubicle components that go in, modular desking, depending upon what type of uh, marketing these groups are doing or what kind of uh, operation they're running. And then of course, management on open concept. So you're, you're saving quite a bit of cost on that, putting in the sheetrock, electrical, tape, float, paint, so on and so forth. Jerry, what components are offered in modular office furniture? Oh my God, there's a whole variety of things. You're obviously going to start out with your panels is basic. You can have panels with fabric, you can have panels with windows, you can have panels with glass etching in it if you wanted to put your company logo in to make it fancy. You've got your countertops, you've got your drawer below counter storage units, you've got your upper storage units which are open shelf and or closed flipper doors. You've got powered at the base, you have powered at the midline raceway. Uh, you have glass treatments from a standpoint if you're doing desking that are actually privacy screens to keep privacy from one side of it to another if you're doing a teaming concept. Um, if you get into the upper management level units, you've got built-in P-tops or, or E-tops, which are the different configuration of tops. Uh, there's wall units that can be hutches added to the units, glass doors, no glass doors. It's actually endless, the, the amount of components you can do. So a really kind of visit with you, tailor it to the needs of your staff and your, uh, your management style. So Jerry, we have a lot of people asking us, what is the time frame for installation? Uh, depending upon the size of the project, it could be anywhere from one to two days up to three or four or five days, depending upon the different components or the size of the project. We recently did a project where it was about a three to four week lead time on the product installation because of the size of the project. So it's all based on the size and like I said, it could be anywhere from a small project up to a large project. So there's variances in the time frames. Jerry, thank you very much. Guys, for more information, please check out our website at www.cubature.com.